वेलकम टू एस एस टी कॉलेज ऑफ आर्ट्स एंड कॉमर्स दिस इज एस एस टी एजुपीडिया एंड माई नेम इज असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर हर्षदा दरेकर स्टूडेंट्स टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अ टॉपिक फ्रॉम सब्जेक्ट एजेंसी मैनेजमेंट सेमेस्टर फाइव टी वाई बी एम एम सी एंड द टॉपिक फॉर टूडे इज सेल्फ प्रमोशन मैनेजमेंट बिफोर मूविंग टूवर्ड्स आवर टॉपिक आई वुड लाइक टू टेल अ स्टोरी दिस इज अ स्टोरी अबाउट टू फ्रेंड्स let us name them sita and geeta they both are very creative and they do business of jewelry making they both have a good public relation skills and uh, they are very creative but there is a difference sita's products are very fine and so uh, perfect and it has the ready made look and geeta's products were uh, not that much fine but still the profit which gained by geeta was so much and sita though her products were very fine she uh, had very low business why this happened because when you are in market when you are in business you are supposed to do advertisements you are supposed to do sales promotions and today we are going to learn about sales promotions तो सेल्स प्रमोशंस की वजह से हम जिस भी बिजनेस में हैं वहाँ पे हमें बहुत सारा प्रॉफिट हो सकता है वो कैसे होता है ये हम जरूर जानेंगे सो लेट एस सी व्हाट वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न टुडे टुडे इज आउटलाइन व्हाट इज सेल्स प्रमोशन रोल एंड स्कोप ग्रोथ ऑफ सेल्स प्रमोशन एडवांटेजेस ऑफ इट एंड इट्स लिमिटेशन लेट एस सी वन बाय वन वॉट इज सेल्स प्रमोशन Sales promotion includes those sales activities that supplement in personal selling and advertising and coordinate and help to make them effective such as display shows and expositions and demonstrations there these are short term incentives to encourage purchase or sale of a product or service when you sell something uh, in previous example when we discussed sita and geeta geeta must have promoted her products and sita uh, must have not done that agar aap apne whatsapp status pe facebook pe instagram pe apne products display karte ho logo ko batate ho to logo ko pata chalega ki aapke paas kis tarike ke products hai aur wo tab unko aap se khareedenge so self promotion is very important let us see characteristics of self promotions communication they gain attention and provide information that may lead the customer to the product if you will do the sales promotion properly very effectively then people will get attention they will get attracted towards your product and then of course they will find them uh, very interesting and if they feel like buying them then you will get profit out of that even people get information about your particular product by the sales promotions then incentives they incorporate some concession contribution that gives value to the customer this is very important everyone likes concessions so concession is considered uh, very well and contribution uh, when we see the advertisements like uh, shanti amla and they say that uh, if you will buy this you will be contributing to the society so this adds a value to the product and because of that customers tend to buy it because they feel like they are also contributing something to the society then invitation they include the a distinct invitation to encourage or engage in the transaction now we always see uh, the captions like hurry and the offer is valid till or only for today so that is indirectly an invitation for the customers because of that also uh, sales is done very well nowadays we are in festival mood so we get so many advertisements and uh, so many sales promotions are there and we are used to it uh, you can see here also uh, there are exchange festivals new offers are there 50% or 40% off is very common and we all know this then uh, special offers are there Uh, we buy things uh, when we see the discount or uh, when it is for limited time then also we hurry 
like this cells are there uh, 20 percent 30 60 percent discount is there even 80 to 90 percent uh, discount is also offered by the companies so we all know about uh, sales promotion now let us see the role and scope of it why it is important why uh, we do need sales promotions when we are into a business first to attract new customer base of course if you won't display your product or you won't showcase your product people won't get attracted towards it so when you do the sales promotion people get attracted to your product and because of that you get new customer base uh, to launch new product of course uh, you have to show people that you are launching something new so show uh, to show new product sales promotion is important to increase sales volume even if you have a product which is already existing but if you want to increase your sales volume then these sales promotions help to obstruct the competitors marketing efforts uh, everyone is uh, taking efforts while they are marketing their products when you do it so uh, effectively when you promote your product with sales promotions then uh, it helps you to obstruct the competitors marketing efforts to encourage the dealers to stock the products thus to sell more of course agar dealers aapke products ka stock nahi rakhenge to wo sell nahi hoga aur jab aap koi offers dete ho ya fir sales promotion karte ho to dealers bhi uh, bahut interest leke uh, aapke products ka stock karte hain aur usko zyada se zyada sell karne ki koshish karte hain and these sales promotions help them to sell more and of course to win the customer preference customers bhi usi cheez ko preference dete hain jahan pe unko acha khasa sales promotion dikhe nowadays uh, we can see the sales promotion increasing there is a growth in sales promotion why these happen why these things happen let us discuss the reasons of it first is increased price sensitivity of customer customer purchase those products which are available at discount price right now we are in the same phase we are getting so many offers and so many discounts and we tend to pry, uh, buy uh, those things which are offered as a uh, discount or at a discount price then uh, people are very clever nowadays so they wait for the uh, sell or uh, the offers increased competition customer may switch over the competitors brand owing to the discount offered by them agar aapka competitor bahut zyada achhi offer de raha hai to customer wo brand chhod ke dusre brand mein bhi convert ho sakte hai wo shayad soch sakte hai ki mujhe ye brand mein zyada offers mil rahe hai to same cheez mein dusri company se le lunga to there is a competition there is a big competition then excessive stock there is always excessive stock so promotion techniques are the great help to attract consumer towards the unsold product we always see the stock clearance sell so in that sell we get so many products at a very low cost so uh, these trends are uh, running nowadays now let us see the advantages of it sales promotion tools immediately catch the attention of consumers because because of those sales promotions if they are done very effectively then people get attracted to the product manufacturer can motivate the consumer to switch over from competitors brand to his brand as we already discussed if the sales promotion is done very effectively then customers tend to buy products from the other manufacturer so that is also an advantage for the uh, businessmen then sales promotion encourages the repeat purchase if you find it very nice if you find the product very nice at a very low price then people tend to buy it again and again there are some limitations also let us see what are they offers for limited time yes because these offers are not long lasting uh, they are seasonal and because of that uh, short term profit is uh, gained by the manufacturer so it is not a long term profit uh, scheme Sales promotion has increased the price sensitivity sensitivity of consumers because people wait for the 
offers people wait for the season to come uh, if you are in august month and uh, you want to buy some watch then uh, you will wait for the dates like 14 15 16 because you know that every year there is there are so many sale uh, offers or sales are there and uh, you don't buy things uh, prior to that sale so that also affects the business uh, because of that you can gain the profit only for the limited people if not handled properly that can create misunderstandings about the brand ye bhi ho sakta hai because people might feel that if you are selling something at a very low cost it means your product is not that much worthy so they may feel that poor quality products are sold at the discounted rates so you have to take care when you are promoting your product or you are offering any uh, sales promotions because uh, it should be handled very carefully and properly so these are the things we have discussed in this session uh, let us see we have discussed what is sell promotions then role and scope of it growth of sales promotions advantages of it and of course its limitations hopefully you have understood all the things we have discussed today we will meet in next session till then take care bye thank you